Hey, what's up, guys? The Kevin Mendoza here, coming at you with a voiceover explanation of my last video. My last video showed Amanda struggling with a deadlift. It showed me giving her some cues, and it showed a before and after shot of how it all worked out. But it didn't really explain anything, so here's the explanation of what happened. First, she struggles. You could tell by the vibration going on, the earthquakes that's happening. First adjustment I made was to narrow her stance just slightly so that way all of her force production is underneath her hips. Second, I told her to root her feet into the floor by telling her to push her big toe into the floor. All that does is it creates an arch in the foot and her weight is distributed a lot more evenly across her entire foot. Torque in the hip, I put my fingers on the outside of her knees. I told her to push up against my fingers so that way she creates tension in her glutes. And then for the lat engagement, I put my pinkies behind her armpit and then I told her to squeeze my pinky so that way she would have to cover her armpit with her tricep, engaging the lats. So let's see how this set finishes. Constantly cueing her to push the knees out, push the big toe on the floor, engage the lats. So that set looked like it moved a lot smoother than what we saw earlier in this video. Here's a side-by-side -side comparison to see the difference. Even though the video on the right was shot two sets after the video on the left, she should be more fatigued, but the bar speed is a lot faster, she locks out a lot stronger, and after she drops the bar, she doesn't look as disappointed. So there you have it, four tips, four cues to help out your deadlift. Try those out, let me know in the comments below if they help out, and follow me on Instagrams. Peace.